Hello everybody, my name is Brian and we are going to start a new tutorial of AutoCAD 2015. Uh, if you are starting AutoCAD, you should see this tutorial that it's going to be a basic tutorial. If you are uh, an advanced AutoCAD user, you should see my other tutorials that I have inside my channel. So check my channel. Okay, let's start. Today we are going to see the home charts that is right over here. We have insert chart, annotate, parametric view and other stuff. We're going to see today the home chart. Also, you can see that uh, we are going to explain uh, what we have around the AutoCAD. For example, if we go down over here at the bottom of the, of the monitor, you are going to see here we can type our commands. You can type the command instead of uh, clicking the command right over here. It's like um, much faster. Also, where it says here command, you're going to see what command you typed and what uh, properties the command has. Right over here at the right, uh, we have the wheel. This wheel is going to be very useful for uh, rotating the, the model or viewing the top or the bottom or, or other parts of the model we are going to draw. And down over here, we are going to have uh, some other properties that we are going to see them uh, on my next video. Okay, let's start drawing. First, we are going to make lines. Lines, you can go right over here, select with the left click line, one click, and you can make easily the line you want. Okay, enter. You can escape, or enter is the same for cancelling the this uh, command. Other way you can do it, you can select L from line, you can see here it says L, enter, and here it says command line. So now we are going to make the line again. Okay, we have different type of lines, in this case we are making a line you can make a polyline, is this one. The difference is that when you're making the line, you can see there is no difference, but when you are selecting the line, you can see here I have one line, two lines, three lines, and here if I'm selecting just one, it's just one line. So if you are making one polyline, it's better because uh, it's uh, way less when you're drawing. Okay, next thing we are going to see is how to select. In AutoCAD uh, you have two types or more types of selecting. You can just come to the object and select it like with one click, like that. But if I want to select the complete object, you just have to click outside and move, for example, to the left or click and move to the right. If you see when moving to the right you can see that the the the, the screen goes in color blue and if you go to the left it goes on green. The meaning is if you go to the left and you select just a little part from the object it will select the complete object. Let's see it again. A little part of the object. I'm not selecting this line, but I'm selecting these two, so it selects both objects. Now, if I go to the right in blue, you can see no objects are selected, but if I select the complete object, that, that's the complete line, it will select it. That's the reference in selecting. If I make a polyline, it's the same thing. If I select a little bit, it will select everything because it's uh, it's just one line. If I select the other way, it won't select. If I select a part of the line, it won't select. You should select complete line. Now, um, having uh, AutoCAD 2015, there are new stuff like you can select making other movements like this one. If I go to the right but without uh, pushing my mouse uh, button, you can make 
the shape you want.